Hey guys, what's going on? My name is Joe, and welcome to a quick little tutorial that has been requested to me so many times. Now, a lot of you guys actually ask me what my HUD is. I'll show a few comments that I've received on the screen now, and I'm just going to show you what my HUD is and how to install a HUD, because I've actually been requested how to install a HUD a few times, and a lot of you guys may not know how, and just simply are bored of the current HUD you have. So, uh, just showing you, this is my stock HUD. This is the one that you get when you install the game. Uh, excuse the messy backpack, but yeah, this is the HUD you get when you install the game so I'm going to show you how to change that to a new custom HUD so without further ado let's get straight into you choosing your HUD so you're going to want to head over to this website known as HUDs.tf there will be a link in the description but what this is is essentially people upload their created HUDs for you guys to download and install so I'm going to close my TF2 now just for when we actually download the HUD and install it so I'm not taking credit for any of these HUDs all of them belong to their rightful creator but yeah this is uh, where I pick from my HUD so as you can see there's a bunch of them there that all look really nice and I actually used a HUD uh, known as a HUD so uh, here it is created by Nock and uh, it's a really simplistic HUD this is like uh, the one I used for quite a while and it's just really simplistic really basic uh, doesn't have anything over complicating it too much so what you're gonna want to do from here is you scroll through make sure you like the way it looks in all these screenshots it's a really clean HUD so I'd suggest this one this is the one I used and this is like for everyone that wanted to know this is like the HUD that I use in all my videos so you're going to want to scroll down on this page there's all the information about it there um, what it's supported on and stuff like that and you're just going to want to hit the big green download button uh, what this will do is it will obviously open up a box um, asking you to download the zip you will need a is like a WinRAR or like a 7 zip or something and you will get this zip so you open the zip and you will be greeted with a a folder called a HUD master now you don't actually need to do anything like um, extract the file or anything it's, it's literally as simple as going over to your Team Fortress 2 folder through Steam Steam apps common clicking the TF button and clicking custom if you don't have a custom folder then just simply create one but I think most people do so hit custom and just drag and drop into this folder now what this will do is just install all the HUD's files into your custom folder so this is where I have like my pulse and kill streak machines and any view model changes that I have so um, I'm going to launch my TF2 now and it should have successfully installed a HUD. So as you can see I just launched a game and here we have a HUD. It's obviously like a completely different layout to as it was before. You go into the backpack and you have this cool little AD scroller and all the pages are presented differently. Also I'm not sure if everyone gets this but normally when I install a HUD you click on a class to view your loadout and it's actually really cool. If you hold the right click and drag your mouse down you actually zoom out and zoom back in if you move your mouse forward. It's a really cool aspect and it allows you to look at loadouts a lot more fully and it's just generally a really nice feature. So I really do hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial uh, if it did help you out or simplify the process or anything like that Then do let me know in the comments below. It's gonna be really awesome to hear your feedback uh, If you do want me to do sort of more tutorials like this then leave your suggestions down below of what you guys need help with That's just about it guys. Thank you all again so much for watching and peace